Ooh, there's a hair cross. I hope he doesn't have guts. That's all I'll say. I'm gonna hit him with Will O' Wisp. Hello friends, my name is Brandon Dayton, I'm your humble narrator, and welcome to Pokemon Days number two. We've got a Tangrowth, Gardevoir, uh, Landorus, pretty cool rock polish, Slowking has Slack Off, that's awesome, uh, Flinch, Paraflinch, Togekiss, and uh, Recovering Sableye. So pretty stolly, pretty trolly, very much a team I like, so we're gonna try and sleep powder this Caldeo. Yeah, he hits me with Icy Wind. Knew something bad was gonna happen right there, and we missed the sleep powder. Something bad happened again! Oh my god! Do it again. Uh, yeah, do it again, I think. You can't switch anything into Icy Wind, really. Maybe Slow King. If this, if this, uh, sleep powder misses, I'm gonna have to switch out to Slow King. Luckily, Tangrowth and Slow King have Regenerator, so they will be able to troll quite quite well in this battle, even though Tangrowth doesn't have... Oh, he does have a recovery move. He has Synthesis. But, I would never use that. <laughs> Much rather just switch out for the recoveries. So, um, I guess Slow King it is. Hooray! Here he comes. The Man of Mans. <laughs> and I like how the music matched up just there. Icy Wind on Slow King. No problem! I got plenty of stuff to hit him. I could get Psychic or Grass Knot, but I'm gonna Thunder Wave him first just in case he makes a switch. And I can pair or cripple whatever comes out. I don't know. I don't know. What's Keldeo got to hit Slow King? Not a lot. I don't think. Show me what you got, bro! What you gonna do, kid? Hitting power. Not even super effective, bro. You should have switched out. You should just run, dude. Now we're gonna do the psychic. Fucking blast this thing. I'm sure it's gonna gonna sack it pretty good. Come on. I want it. Pick your move. That's not gonna work. You're not gonna get to do it. <laughs> I hope you guys like the new background that I put up too. I decided instead of stretching the video and making it all ugly, that we could we could do a little background action. So um big big thanks to Yatan for the fire and water starter backgrounds, and a big thanks to the psychic type for the music. Alright, so Keldeo's gone finally. Jellicent comes in. Um, kind of scared of Jellicent. I'm gonna go back into Tangrowth. I, I don't know. Tangrowth doesn't have that much special defense, but if he does go for a water move, I might be able to get some more regenerator healing on the Tangrowth. And if not, then, uh, that's fine too, I suppose. Right now, I'm trying to wear down uh, any water types he might have because I do want to save my Landorus, so I'm not going to show that to him just yet. But uh, I will bring it in to probably clean up, clean up this mess this kid brought to the battle, son. Take your fucking messy team home. Oh, I got sacked. <laughs> fucking nailed with the Shadow Ball. So Jellison comes out on top of Tangrowth. Can't really go to Slow King or Gardevoir uh, because of the Shadow Ball. I think Togekiss is a good pick. We'll get some para flinching going. Hopefully, we can take this thing out. I know Jellicent is a beast with the special defense. So, uh, keep your fingers crossed, I guess. I don't know. You! Ooh! Bring it, kid. What do you got? Ice Beam? I ain't scared of no fucking Ice Beam, son. Ooh. You like a thunder wave? Oh, and you got paralyzed on the on the thunder wave move. That's great. So now enjoy some air slash. You like air slash, don't you? Sure you do. Flinchy flinch. Do it again. We gotta be a dick. <laughs> Get ahead in this battle. Come on. It's got like a a thirty percent chance to hit me or something. And there it goes. And I'm frozen. Fuck! <laughs> uh, my hacks have been turned on me. This is not good. I'm gonna try and unfreeze, I guess. Um, it's not looking good for Togekiss at the moment. Oh, shit! We got one more chance to unfreeze. We can fr fucking sack him in the next turn if we unfreeze. And if not, then we're dead. And we're down a poke. Well, that Jellison's basically crippled, so... I will call us neck and neck still. 
but uh, I do need to get more of his water types out of there to clear the way for Randorosi! Stabilize coming out, because he's going to be faster for sure with that thing paralyzed, and I'm going to knock it off. If he wants to save it for fodder, I'll knock off whatever uh, switch is in, or he can just leave it and get his free switch now. Which is a really good strategy to fodder Pokemon. If uh, you find a switch that is nice and safe, then you can save your switch for later, somewhat. And uh, just bring in your basically dead Pokemon, have it killed, and then you get a free switch to whatever you like to counter your opponent. Which is pretty important in a game like this. It's like a big old chess game with a bunch of freaky looking dudes. <laughs> Ooh, the fucking trap remix. You like that, son? Oh! <laughs> I'm not really worried with my Sableye out here because he has a pretty good special D. And, uh, ooh, there's a hair cross. I hope he doesn't have guts. That's all I'll say. I'm gonna hit him with Will O Wisp because, uh, this Sableye seems to be stronger on the special defense side than, uh, Da, 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 da. Physical. So there's the burn. Fucking. Okay, he substitutes. That's fine. I think he's gonna try and get some sword stances up, so I'm going to taunt him. Because the knockoff is not gonna get through his substitute. Because it's a dark move and he is fighting. So we're just gonna kinda try and stall him out here, I guess. I'll go for the knockoff because I don't really have much else to do. And he hits me with Bullet Seed. Mega Heracross has skill link, so it will hit five times every time, which uh, is pretty nice, I suppose, but I don't think it's going to be enough to save him. Um, yeah, I hope this breaks the sub. If not, then we're going to be in some trouble, because his taunt is going to wear off, and if he gets those sword stances up, my, my Sableye's done for sure. So I'm going to taunt again, hope he goes for a sword stance, and not a bullet seed, because I think a bullet seed will kill me at this point. <laughs> you're, you're a brave hero! Oh yeah, there's the bullet seed. Oh my god! You can live! No, you can't. You've been a fucking hero, Sableye, so now we're down a poke. But again, his dude's super crippled, so... I'm going to bring in the Randrosi! And see if we can't set up a rock polish on this crippled ass hair across. Because I'm not really scared of Bullet Seed or Stone Edge or Close Combat or anything he can do, really. So, yeah, break the sub, I suppose. Why not? We only really need one Rock Polish on Landorus to outspeed a good majority of the metagame. And since we're in randoms, he might end up with uh, unevolved folks, even. So, I'm not too worried. I'm gonna get him right here, boy. What you gonna do? Bullet seed, probably. I think he's praying for those crits. But, uh, yeah, there goes one. Damn. Shouldn't have said anything at all. <laughs> and he's burned to death. Hooray! Sable, I got a kill, even though he's dead. That's how ghosts work, don't you know? Oh, <laughs> uh, I'm sad Gardevoir hasn't seen battle yet, and Slowking saw like a second. Oh, that Tentacruel is going to get fucking slammed by Earthquake. Tentacruel has huge special defense, but not much on the physical side. And he's part poison, so even though he is a water type, um, it's not a threat to my Randoros. Yeah! See you in hell, son! You! <laughs> oh, this fucking... This jam has me amped up. Oh, fuck. Delibird. If it has if it has a uh, ice shard, we're dead. But I'm gonna go for Stone Edge, just because I want Gardevoir to see some shit. And yeah, no ice shard, no nothing. I don't know what he was gonna do. Maybe he was gonna give me a present. That's what Delibirds like to do. Mm -hmm. Oh, Avalug, you big bastard. I guess I'll go for Superpower. Cause this will probably be my last turn. And it might hit harder than Stone Edge. I don't know. Unless Stone Edge crits. But Stone Edge might miss too! Fucking Stone miss. I hate it. Yeah, we'll go for close combat. Or. Er, super power. Super power! Break 
like this ice slug up, ice turtle, whatever the fuck you are, get the fuck out of here. Pick a move so I can smash your face already. Yeah! Oh, not even half. That thing's got a huge special or physical defense. But that's fine because both of my characters left are special attackers, so I guess I'll send in Gardevoir. Just uh, give him some action, you know, action Jackson. Here we go, here we go, here we go! I'm a Mega Evolve and Will-O-Wisp, I guess. If I try to side shock it, it'll hit the physical defense side, which won't do very much damage even though it is the same type of attack. So I think I'm gonna go for Hyper Voice on the next turn. And uh, I don't really think he'll be able to KO me unless he gets a crit. <clears throat> because I should be faster. I don't know much about the new pokes from like um, Gen 6 or whatever, but yeah, it's X and Y. Um, but Pokemon Showdowns helped me slowly learn the meta game. obviously. That guy has some freaking defense we gotta get through, so we're gonna Hyper Voice right now. We're gonna take him out, I hope. Maybe. Probably. I don't know. He might have a good special defense, too. Wouldn't that be fucked up, son? No, my kid! Oh, no, fuck him. <laughs> so this has been Pokemon Mondays. I've been Brandon Dayton, your humble narrator. I do hope that you will join us for the next time. Until then, friends. Bye-bye! One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Bye, goodbye, see you, my friend.